And the Ministry of Gender, Children and Social Protection has urged traditional and religious leaders to play leading roles on child protection issues. This, according to the Ministry, will address the various issues affecting children. Sector Minister Nanao Yelitha assured there is a draft national child and welfare policy that has been produced to, to be finalized this year. Over 17,000 children are homeless and living on the streets in Ghana. To address these challenges, the Ministry of Gender, Children and Social Protection has called on traditional and religious leaders to assist since they command respect in their communities. Leading the crusade to show children the right and proper ways in life, according to the ministry, would make a great impact. Minister of Gender, Children and Social Protection, Nana Oyelitha, in an interaction with religious leaders, expressed worry over the rate at which children are neglected. The support religious bodies have been given has not been systematic and not been coordinated. So we are bringing them on board systematically so that they can better, they can help us in protecting children. Issues including early and forced marriages, violence, sexual abuse and exposure to pornographic pictures, if not stopped, according to the minister, will prevent Ghana from achieving the MDG Goal 1. Looking at the rates at which our children are getting on the streets, uh, we need to do better. We need to teach them good morals and we need to give them the necessary support that they need to be able to stay off the streets and get doing something better for themselves. Until a child is grown, before the society can recognize that child as an adult, you need to go through certain customary rights. And today, you have children becoming adults when they are not yet adults. Speakers at the discussion all appealed to traditional and religious leaders to join hands to achieve a common goal.